hood movies. What's y'all's favorite hood movie? If we was ranking these bitches. You see what I'm saying? I don't, you know what I mean? But I, I know, I know where I stand on a lot of shit. I know where I stand. Wait, but what are some of these? Some of these hot boys? Hot boys is, mmm. The Warriors? How's The Warriors a hood movie? Goodfellas, I've damn near never seen it. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Baby Boy, where is Baby Boy? Ba where's Baby Boy? No, where is Baby Boy? That's damn near the funniest movie ever made. Okay, Baby Boy is goaded. We just gonna go ahead and put Baby Boy at goaded, all right? That's, that's easy, hands down. He got game with Denzel Washington and, and what they got, Ray Allen in it, the Hooper. I'm going to have to say, I'm sorry, Denzel is my nigga. Denzel is my boy. Like, I, like I, I think Denzel is the greatest actor of all time. But I'm going to have to say that shit is trash. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry, Denzel. I just, it wasn't my favorite movie. But, but to go ahead and redeem my boy, Training Day, goaded. My nigga. Goaded. Training <laughs> Day is hands down top five movies ever. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm not, I'm not, no if ands, or buts about it. Now, we get into other shit like Casino. Casino, I'm looking, that looks like it is Robert De Niro. I have never seen Casino. I have never seen Casino. So is it fair that I'm going to put this as trash? My bad, De Niro. I fucks with you heavy. Hot Boys. I did watch Hot Boys. I did. I have seen Hot Boys with Silk the Shocker, Snoop Dogg. Uh, I don't know. I got a couple other motherfuckers. I think this was from, this was a No Limit film. You know, when Master P was doing his thing. I'm going to have to say, I'm sorry, P. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, because I, I fucks with Master P heavy, but I'm going to have to say that shit was trash. Okay. Now, now it, it's going to be hard trying to fill up these middle sections, because it's like, I'm a fan of a lot of these shits. Deep Cover? I don't even remember that. What is that other joint? What did I say? A Bronx Tale? I've never seen it. I've never seen a Bronx Tale. I've never seen a Bronx Tale. Tales from the Crypt. Looking back at it, looking back at Tales from the Crypt, it wasn't phenomenal. It wasn't crazy. But when we as kids, man, that shit was fire. Like it was. I don't give a fuck. 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 When I was a young nigga, you couldn't tell me that shit wasn't fire. So I'm not. I'm not even going. I'm a. It was. It was decent. Tales from the Crypt was decent. It was definitely decent. Okay, now. We are going into Paper Soldiers. Paper Soldiers. That's a tough one. That's a tough one. Because I know a lot of niggas who've never seen that movie. Like, if you bring this up in, in, in just casual conversations, a lot of people have never seen it. This was the first time I ever seen Kevin Hart in a movie. Funny as shit. Like, damn near one of the most laughable films you gonna find like as far as like the comedy in that shit it got it got benny siegel charlie murphy kevin hart fucking nori uh a bunch of other people i'm gonna have to say it's damn near to me it's damn near uh, i don't know that's tough is it classic or is it goaded damn it's damn near it's damn near damn near goaded but i don't want to do it so we're going to put it as classic. Paper Soldiers is a classic. How high? How high? I'm going to have to say, going back to it, when How High first came out, I would have put it as goaded. When it first came out, I would have put it as goaded. But now that it stood the test of time, you can kind of see where it, where it lasts in the rankings and shit. I'm going to have to say, how high, this is my opinion, how high to me is, man, that's tough, bro. That's tough, because I want to say it's good, but it fuck around reach classic. It fuck around be a classic. It's either good or classic. Ah, uh, man, that's tough. I'm going to fuck it. I'm going to get them niggas classic. Paid in full? Classic. 
Uh, pay them full fuck around, be goaded. Pay them full. I'm going to say classic. Blue Hill Avenue. Shout out to anybody in the chat right now who ever seen Blue Hill Avenue. That's my shit. So I'm going to have to say that is good. That's a good, a damn good movie. If you haven't seen it, you should definitely watch it. Four Brothers, I wouldn't consider this a hood movie, to be totally honest with you, but it's a gangster movie. It's a gangster movie, and it's a damn good movie. That's a good-ass story. Mark Wahlberg, Tyrese Gibson, Andre 3000, everybody in that joint killed it. Menace to Society. That is my favorite movie of all time. I'm going to go ahead and put that as goaded. I fucks with that heavy. Okay, now, Friday. My nigga. Everybody in the chat, y'all already know where we're going with this. Y'all know where we going with this. Go to fuck around be the greatest. It is the greatest hood comedy film of all time. Okay. Now, set it off. Set it off is crazy, man. Set it off is crazy. Niggas going, hey, 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 hey. Niggas going to have to put set it off as a classic. What the fuck is hoodlum? What the fuck is Hoodlum? I see Lawrence Fishburne is in it. That's my guy. But I'm going to put that shit as trash just because I haven't seen it. I'm sorry. Okay. I got the hookup. I have seen that. And once again, Master P is that nigga. He done made, you know what I mean? Bro definitely made his mark in history, but I'm going to put that shit as trash. Okay. Eight Mile. Eight Mile, I wouldn't consider a hood movie. Uh, Maybe. I, uh, I don't know. But I'm going to just put that as a damn, it's a good movie. It's a good film. I'm sure we've all seen it. South Central is my shit. Hold on. Whoever seen South Central when he, hey, hey, even, hey, Ray Ray got, Ray Ray, even Ray Ray got, got got your boy still still in the car studios. That's that shit. Hold on. I'm going to go ahead and put that as a, I'm going to put South Central as a classic. That's a classic. That's a classic. Above the Rim. Above the rim, it's a damn it's a shame what shame happened to what flip. Happened flip. I'm gonna go ahead and put that shit as a classic. Do the right thing. I've watched that, bro. I love the nigga Spike Lee. I love everything he stand for, but I don't like the movie. I'm sorry. I gotta put that shit as trash. All right, Juice. I was liking Juice for a long time. I was fucking with Juice, but it was because more so because I'm a Pac fan. So it's not even fair. I'm going to just keep it just watching the movie. It's, eh, it was decent. It was decent. Juice is decent. I don't, you know what I mean? It's not something that I ever want to watch again. Fresh. Fresh is an interesting pick because I don't hear a lot of niggas talk about this when we talk about hood films. Hood films, I'm going to definitely say uh, Fresh is a good ass movie. It's not something that I've watched like, you know what I mean? You can't just keep watching it over and over. But it's a good movie, though. It's a good story. Scarface? This is Scarface? Hell yeah, Scarface is goaded. Okay, that's easy. Dead Presidents. Dead Presidents, it's walking a fine line between... Because it's kind of dry at times, but it's a damn good story. There's hella good scenes. Y'all know that bank robber scene. So it's between good and classic. I'm going to put that shit as a classic because of the ending with Chris Tucker. Oh, my goodness. Y'all already know what it do. Sugar Hill. I have never seen this. Once again, got to do y'all dirty. I'm going to put that shit as trash. I've never seen it. King of New York. That's another one. I've never seen it. I'm going to have to put that shit as trash. Okay. Don't be a menace. Don't be a menace. Woo, that's that shit. Don't be a menace is that shit. I'm going to go ahead and put that as a classic. Or is it goaded? Is don't be a menace goaded? Damn, that's a good ass question. Is it goaded? I'm going to put that shit as a classic. Shotters. Shotters. Shotters is my shit. Hell yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and put that as a good film. If you haven't seen Shotters, Go ahead and check that out. Tell me how you feel about Mad Max. <laughs> Shadows is damn near classic, though. It does have to move up because it's not. It's past the level of fresh. Where's the city of God at? Where is the city of God? How you got hood movies without the city of God? What type of shit is this? What type of shit is that? 
Okay, colors. Colors is it fuck around. It's then walking a thin line between classic and good. Damn, I fuck with colors, but I'm gonna put it as good. It's it's right there with fresh. Fresh is fire. Carlito's way, it was decent. Carlito's way was decent. The Warriors, I've I I, I know what the Warriors is. I see people do spoofs of it and shit like that, but I've never watched the movie. Y'all niggas, I'm going to have to put that as trash. Nobody kill me because I know a lot of niggas like that movie, but I'm, I'm putting it as trash. I've never seen it. Okay. Uh, Goodfellas. Is this the one? Hold on. Is Goodfellas the one of uh, where dude snitched? What is that called? What the fuck is that movie called? Maybe I'm mixing that up with something else. Is Goodfellas where the nigga snitched, basically? Good fellas, is somebody snitching that? Just let me know. New Jack City, New Jack City to me, yeah, he snitched. Okay, so that's that movie. I fucks with that. I feel like it's uh, mm, it was it was decent. It was decent. It was decent. It ain't up there with fresh, but it was decent. A Bronx Tale, A Bronx Tale. I've never seen it, so that shit is trash. All right, New Jersey Drive. That's walking a fine line. Fuck it. New Jersey Drive is a classic, man. State property. What's crazy is, I know a lot of niggas like the first state property. I think the second was better. So I'm going to just go ahead and say, eh, it was decent. State property was decent. Poetic Justice. Once again, I'm a huge pop fan. That's my nigga. Hell of an actor. Hell of a rapper. So I'm going to go ahead, but 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 to keep it real... The movie was was too rom rommy. It's too romantic. All right, so we gonna put that as uh, it was decent. All right, Boys in the Hood, Boys in the Hood, man, this shit was deep. Boys in the Hood is deep. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that as a that that's a mm, to me it's a it's a good movie. I don't it ain't, it can't be up there. Boys in the Hood is not up there with South Central to me. It's not up there with South Central. It's not up there with Paid in Full. It's not up there with Set It Off or Shotters. I'm going to go ahead and put Boys in the Hood at the good section. Belly. Even Belly. Belly's fire on the artistic side of shit from the looks of it. But it can't fuck with New Jersey Drive and shit like that. I'm going to put Belly at good. In Too Deep. In Too Deep, it was decent. In Too Deep was decent. It was decent. New Jack City. Even that, that's 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 a good movie, but I feel like at times it's overrated. Deep cover was crazy as I don't I don't remember this. I don't remember this. But it got my nigga Lawrence Fishburne once again. He's in all the hood classics and shit. Deep cover. Uh, I'm I'm gonna say that shit was trash because I don't remember it. So let me know y'all thoughts on that list right there. That's how we gonna do that right there. And we're gonna leave that.